Yo! Ooh, all right, I'm gonna stop. What is up, guys? Um, I'm bringing you a quick announcement video regarding the Fat Puma, and uh, something you guys need to know is that it is too late for the movie. The movie is a cancellation due to a couple reasons, and that's what I'm going to explain and explain what I'm going to do with the Fat Puma in the future. Uh, that trailer is now going to become what the movie was, but trust me, it is not the final iteration. Uh, so yeah, please ignore that, and, uh, so yeah. Uh, basically what I'm doing now is that I enjoy making the concept trailers way more than I actually enjoy making the actual movie. So that is one reason. Another reason is, is that for some reason... Oh, nice, dude. Fucking faggot. Uh, one reason is... That... Man, I'm drawing a blank while playing the game. I really gotta stop doing my comps. <coughs> but well, another reason is that it has gotten to the point in the year where it is dark by five. And guess what? I get home at three quarter till four. So yeah, that gives me an hour to film. Plus, my parents are home, and my little brother gets home shortly. So got that. And then on the weekends, I really never home alone anymore. So yeah, it's just I can't film. Um, not playing the blame game on anybody else. I can very easily film, but it's just it's not easily. I guess I can film. It won't be easy. Also, I've had a lot of camera issues. The camera I want to use an actual camera instead of my god dang iPhone. You know, I don't. You know, it's just, a, it's better quality to have an actual, actual camera and a lot easier during the editing process. And the issue with that is that my camera, stupid thing, that uh, doesn't work on my computer. Just my computer won't take it. So yeah, I can't use it. It's a worthless piece of crap. I got to work once and then my stupid freaking USB cord broke while in the midst of installing a driver. So now I can't use it. And no matter how many times I've restarted my computer, it won't install the dang drivers. And if you don't know, the Toshiba cameras need drivers to be able to import to your computer correctly. Otherwise, your computer won't recognize it. I had one person tell me that a camera shouldn't need drivers, but every camera does need a driver to be able to import to your computer because every camera records in different, qu different qualities and uh, different file sizes. Therefore, it needs to have a special like idea of what the camera is going to give out. And uh, also to use some of the special camera programs and to utilize it to its full potential. It's just you need drivers, man. Pretty much everything you have in a computer uh, needs a driver. If it does anything more than a basic purpose, which all cameras do, which are basic purposes to take pictures, and they, and they do more than pictures now. And uh, even importing to a computer is counted as uh, more than just taking pictures. So. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff goes into it, and, uh, yeah. I'm not mad at you, I know I'm kind of mad, I'm just mad at the camera itself, I'm not mad at you if you watch this video. The guy left that comment, I'm just saying, it does need a driver. Anyway, guys, this was way longer than I intended, I'm gonna try to bust out another video, but I've been playing so much Halo 5, I don't know why I jumped on Battlefield. Really, I'm not enjoying it that much after Halo 5. I guess, I guess I'm kind of bored of Halo 5, really. It's just, it's kind of boring, honestly, after a while. It's, you gotta love repetition for Halo 5, really, because with the, the multiplayer, there's like three Warzone maps, a couple different maps in Arena, and it's just, yeah. Hey, about the first Halo, they didn't bring back Blood Gulch. I'm not happy about that, about that. I'm actually kind of sad. It was like a Halo tradition. Anyway, guys, I'll see you all later. I'm tired of playing Battlefield, really. I've lost my mojo after Halo 5. I'll see you all later.